I think maybe we start with the course that I teach at the GSP. It's called Health IT and Strategy. And the vision of the course was to think about how can we use technology to improve the quality and reduce the cost of healthcare. Uh, it's concepts we've been talking about for a very long time. You know, can we use telemedicine? Could you uh, use Alexa is the final case in my class about to interact with patients. Well, you know, that was all theoretical when I taught it in December. And in the last month, Stanford uh, has moved from in-person visits to 70% of the outpatient visits being virtual. The technology companies are looking at virtual tracking with iPhones or Salesforce. Uh, they're all trying to get engaged in healthcare using the technology in, in new ways. And, uh, you know, so it's, it's really exciting. We're seeing that the business model in this time of crisis is evolving much quicker than we've seen uh, previously. Um, so the, we could do it. We, we've, been, we've had the capacity to do this for a long time. Uh, but as Libby said, the business model has really gotten in the way. Um, we don't get paid for this stuff. We get paid to do very expensive elective procedures uh, for commercially insured patients. Uh, and the rest of it uh, is, uh, is somewhat of a hobby. Um, I, I, think, uh, I think we now have kind of proof of concept that there are different ways to bring healthcare to the public, that there's probably very different value propositions that we could be uh, considering and should be moving forward on. And I think there's going to be an enormous pushback for people that want to put the genie back in the bottle and go back to the ex ante, how we used to do things six months ago. We know that world. It's a very stable world. It's been a stable world for a long time. Uh, and we don't have to think about the scariness of what do I do with the new building now that none of the patients are coming there and all the doctors are, uh, are working from home, uh, seeing patients over a uh, Zoom conference. So, um, so I think it's a really interesting time and we can get into some of uh, uh, that Libby brought up, some of the ways in which healthcare in the United States is, is a private system and the failures of that, uh, that system and the failures of, you know, very large failures of the public system, uh, the public health system and the public health preparedness as a country. 